big it is and I'm little. And when she showed this to me, I'm like, girl, that is a plus size fanny pack. Oh, how I, oh shit, how I ship, how I package and ship my orders. Y'all, I'll talk for forever. Not the first thing they won't ask me is you have insurance. First class when coming to insurance, you could probably add it on. I'm not sure it's shopping. So, if y'all watching this video, let me turn you back around. <laughs> so, if y'all watching this video, y'all probably already saw that video. Today is Friday. I'm trying to get it up today. I tried to do it last night, but I was sleepy and I was literally fighting my sleep. So that's what I did. I was trying to do one video. I was trying to do a video a day for a week straight, but I didn't succeed in that. So. Sound. But anyways, um, what was I about to say? I struggled with that intro. That was like real life struggle. Like. I'm not about to get on here and buck into my chat. Like, I'm not about to do what everybody else is doing. Like, I've never been one to follow what everybody else is doing. Like, I've never been that way. With clothes, with slang, with none of that. So, y'all just have to deal with me how I am. So, if I just get on here and start talking, that's just what's going to happen. But <laughs> I wanted to show y'all something. And as I kind of like get more into my business videos, I want to kind of like reel y'all in just a little bit because I don't want to just put like everything in y'all face so fast without y'all like kind of having not a background, but like knowing where I started before y'all get to see like all this new stuff that I'm bringing in. Like I want y'all to see like the base of my business and then I'll kind of like reel y'all in. But like yesterday I was telling y'all about that, um, that one piece I had. That one piece I had on yesterday, I'm thinking about trying to sell clothes and stuff like that. But right now, it's just accessories and stuff. Y'all go on my website, y'all can see what I have. So follow me at Love Daddy Alexa on Instagram. And my personal page is just call me Danny, just like my YouTube channel. But add the number five after it. I'm not really active. I've never been like a social media person. But and my page is private. But I guess I'm gonna have to start like being active for me it's more important for y'all to follow me on my uh, my business instagram but anyways i wanted to come in here and show y'all this little top this like little crop top i was thinking about selling and when i say thinking about selling it's like i bought like a very few amount of pieces i think i got like four or five of them so this is kind of like a crop top it kind of remind me of almost like a lifesaver almost So I'm thinking about putting this on the website. Everything is still going to be $20 and under. But that's what I was going to talk to y'all about further down the line too. But everything I sell is $20 and under. But as I'm trying to like progress in my business, I want to start selling other things. But those other things I can't sell for $20. It's going to have to be more than that or it's like, what's the purpose? Or to be like, what's the purpose? Because I'm buying it for twenty dollars and selling it for twenty dollars. That don't make sense. It's either I'm gonna have to either change my little slogan to everything forty dollars and under or something like that, or just keep it twenty dollars and under and just have like a little separate tab in my website and just say over twenty dollars. Because right now I don't have too many items that are over twenty dollars that I was thinking about selling, and I was also. In one of my DIYs, I was telling y'all that I wanted to sell, start selling the jacket that I have on, that I had on in one of the videos. I'll put it right here. But I'm going to show y'all one more thing. And when she showed this to me, I'm like, girl, that is a plus size fanny pack. <laughs> Look how big it is, and I'm little. 
Can y'all see that good? And then she was like, no, this is how you wear it. It feel real soft too. It's real, real soft. But she was like, no, that's not how you wear it. You wear it like this. So she was like, no, you wear it like this. And then in here, you put your hands in here. I'm like, oh, that's cute. And then the colors is cute. I only got them in a couple colors. I got this neon orange, neon green, and then a neon yellow. So I'm like, okay, that's cute. I'll test it out, see how it goes. But it's real soft and to keep your hands warm, even though I don't get cold out here and summer's almost over. I'm like, let me just uh, get a couple of the neon colors. That way I can see how those do, and then I'll just start from there. So if these do well, then I'll just go get some more, but it feels real good, and it's big. So if you are a plus size girl, you can wear this as a fanny pack. It will still be cute. Or even if you're a small girl, it'll still look cute, but it's just, it's gonna take up your whole front, <laughs> or your whole side. But basically, about to show y'all how I take pictures of my products with my um with my phone, and I got an iPod too, so I'm gonna probably show y'all how to do that too. I did start that video a couple days ago, but I felt like it wasn't like it wasn't enough. It would have been a real short video, and to me, I like watching like kind of longer videos, like 10 to 20 minutes long. I didn't want to give y'all like a five minute video, and that was it. Because when I watch somebody's video, it was like, damn, that's it. I want some more. So. And then the one that I'm um, editing now, the autumn clips was probably like more than an hour long. I had no idea I talked that much, but I had a lot of information to give y'all. So hopefully y'all liked that video. And subscribe to my channel, uh, leave a comment, and let me know what other business videos y'all want to see or whatever type of videos, whether it's cooking. I already recorded a few cooking videos, so I'm going to end up putting those up too. And I'm about to get started because once again, I'm about to lose sunlight. So, let's start. Oh, I need my blanket. And yes, I do like um, Bob's Burger. But I think I bought this for, I mean, for, I think I bought this iPod in 2000 and, uh, I want to say 13. I want to say the beginning of, 20, no, I bought it in, in, January is 2014, so whatever version that is, that's the version I have. And it still takes good pictures, but it's just like certain apps I can't download. But it don't matter anyway because I barely use it. So I'm going to show y'all. So I'm going to show you how I take pictures of my products with my... Let's start with the uh, Samsung first. But the first thing that I do, that I do do is, um, this is just like one of them poster boards where you do like school um school projects and stuff i got this from the dollar tree two for a dollar you can get this from the 99 cent store two for a dollar and y'all also get a a sneak peek at some of my new inventory because i just bought this stuff and i have to take pictures of it so y'all get to see that too okay so with my samsung i just go into where i take my pictures at and sometimes i like to do selective focus because it gives you like okay let me see i'm gonna show y'all let me back this up because it's showing like the wood it's showing my floor so i like to line up my products kind of close together because when you take the picture even though it's like this close together it look like it's this far apart so i kind of like put them real close together so I will take my phone. I shoot selective focus. Uh, and then I kind of like angle it where I think it's perfect at. Press selective focus. And you gotta hold it still until that yellow line goes all the way. And then it took the picture. So you see how 
I don't know how close I can get it for y'all but you see how it looks like somebody took the picture but it still looks professional at the same time but it doesn't look like a stock photo does that make any sense and you can also adjust the background if you need to say for example I click adjust background and I can either choose near focus uh, far focus or pan focus if I choose pan it's gonna show it more clearly I gotta lighten this up for y'all uh, write it up son okay so if I choose pan focus it's gonna show like everything clearly if I show far focus it's gonna blur this part out I don't want that blurred out and if it show near focus it's gonna focus on this right here and kind of blur that out y'all can barely see it but it's still like a good photo so if I do pan it's gonna show everything clearly and that still looks like a good photo but it doesn't look like everybody like it doesn't look like it's from a website that's what I was trying to say so that should make more sense okay so I'm gonna take pictures of them individually because that's what I like to do for my website too take them individually and then take them all together okay so i'm still gonna choose selective focus since there's nothing else to focus on okay let me put this in the background since there's only one thing to focus on so i'm gonna click i'm gonna choose this selective focus that yellow circle try to hold it still you probably gonna be able to hold it still all the way okay and you see how it's focused on this and not this over here it's still like looks like a good photo and I like to take all my pictures in natural lighting so that's what I'm gonna continue to do um the sun is kind of going down so what I'm gonna do is just open the door and some sunlight should be coming in through there so I'm gonna just move my little poster board over there and move my damn house slippers out the way and take my pictures like that so I'm gonna show you how I do that but let me show you how I take it with the um ipod first so if you have an iphone it's gonna be the exact same way so i'm just gonna go to the camera okay now it's on my camera and you just click where you want it to go if you hold it it'll say a e a f lock and then you take the picture and also when you take your pictures, you can adjust the brightness right here. So you can make it either darker or you can make it lighter. And of course I'm gonna make it lighter because you can see it better. 